Hey guys, so today I'm doing a get and ready with me. So if you can't tell, hold on. I used the subculture palette. I got like a mark on it and I'm so mad. I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna get it all. Um but I just like was playing around with it. I played around with it yesterday and I like followed a tutorial and it came out amazing. So I was just like playing around with it and I thought that I would do a get on ready with me video because these are like kind of going around and they're kind of like the get ready with me videos but basically the opposite so this is all going away <laughs> um let's get started this is going to be like a chattier type of video but let's get on with it okay so to start off I take my eyes off so yeah and I also like it looked weird if I like didn't do anything to my brows so I did a little bit to my brows but you know and I did not go out in this just letting y'all know I know it looks so bad <sighs> um but I'm gonna be using the Lancome double action eye maker up remover stuff this stuff is super oily so you like barely need any of it but this does wonders like I want to show this to you guys and like get a little close Okay, so here's my eyeball, looking good. So I'm just gonna wipe this on and then just watch. Ah, that just moved my contact. Like, all that came off, that looks disgusting on there. But, sorry, my eyes are watering now. But I'm gonna use the same eye, as you can see my eyes super oily now. So. Yeah, but I just used the tiniest bit of this. I suppose I'm taking off my concealer under my eyes too right now. Um, but yeah, I just used like, look at the tiniest bit of this stuff. And it takes all that completely off. I think that's crazy. How in the world does it do that? It's just a lot easier and like softer on my eyelids to use this stuff than to use like the cleanser or anything and it comes off so easy also if you're curious like why I don't really fill my brows like if I spoolie them out let me spoolie them out for y'all like I don't know I like they don't look great but like I don't really care so the only time that I really feel in my brows is if if, if, if if it's for a video, I literally don't care how my brows look. Like They look kind of iffy, but that's okay with me. Yeah, so, yeah. All right. Anyways, so now I have like a little bit of makeup off. So I'm going to go ahead and wash my face. I'm going to do this off camera because this is kind of weird. So I am I just like wash my face with a washcloth at night. This is like kind of like my night skincare routine type thing too. Um, but I just wash my face with a washcloth. And I have been using the past couple of days. It's not in here. Oh my goodness. This simple purity whatever cleanser that is like amazing so I'm just gonna use that and wash the rest of my face makeup off of my face Looks super shiny but basically I just take this off oh I forgot to grab the cleanser well it, it's in my haul video that should be up before this it's not up yet but should be up before this video is up so my face gets super red after I wash it so that's why it looks crazy red um but I just go ahead and take my mascara off and instead of going like this and like pulling it I go like this and like go back and forth that way it's not taking my eyelashes out because I want to have eyelashes <laughs> basically it for washing it all off some of this witch hazel toner and I'm just gonna put it on my t-zone <laughs> So yeah, I just basically put it everywhere. Sorry, I'm trying to hurry because I don't want this video to be like forever long. So then I just let that sit as my toner. And I love this because it's like 100% natural and it just feels super soothing. And it's really good if you have sensitive skin or just like regular skin. Just to show you what it looks like a little bit better. 
dual action moisturizer from clean and clear you probably see me use this forever and i use it so much like it's in a million of my videos but i just put it on my face and rub it out like you would a regular moisturizer but i like pat this on there every single night because oh, i get such dry skin it's not even funny okay it kind of is but like it's crazy i like see how oily i look now but it's oil free so it's good but yeah i have to like pack this onto my face if i just want to look like a regular face in the morning <laughs> i i don't even know what this thing is called and i just use this for my under eyes it's supposed to help the bags under your eyes and also just kind of like moisturize and like you know <laughs> so yeah i just take that and rub it in real good yeah i guess you could say this is like my nighttime routine oh my goodness i look so red um but i don't know i just figured that i'd show it to you so i don't know what i'm gonna name this but yeah that is basically it for the video i hope you all enjoyed i promise i don't look this shiny and this red in person okay um but yeah i hope you all enjoyed and i'm sorry this is a super rushed video but yeah anyways i love you guys so much and please like comment and subscribe please let me know what type of videos you want if you want um palette tutorials like on the subculture palette or um more get ready with me's more hauls whatever you want please let me know in the comments below and anyways yeah i'll see you guys next time bye guys